Hello everyone, if you're here you probably know that autoplay is pretty much dead. That means lost clients and lower CVR. If you're not familiar with the new autoplay regulations, I will leave a link down below. Because your time is valuable, I want to keep this review short and show you the functionality of Playboost. First, choose a video platform like YouTube, Vimeo and so on. I myself will choose a uh, YouTube URL, paste it, as you can see on the right side we have a variety of options you can choose from, but uh, right now I'm interested in changing the video image thumbnail, I will upload a thumbnail that I think it fits more and has a much higher quality. Well, I like this one a lot better. Okay, now the interesting stuff. We can add images on the screen, you can add text, emojis, buttons, but for now I'd like to add some GIFs, or at least one, like let's say play. You can upload one yourself on, or you can just search one. The most important thing is to have something moving on your thumbnail so that it will attract your customers and simulate the alpha play. Let's add this here and let's add some buttons or at least one like this. You can resize it. You can edit, move the button, resize it to make it more appealing. You can change its colors. Let's do something like this red line right here. You can center it. Switch up the layers if you need more buttons, more emojis, text or whatever you would like or seem to fit on your thumbnail. You can add an overlay over your thumbnail or a bunch of different patterns that I don't uh, personally use or would like to use on my video. But there are there, I don't know who would actually use them, but there are um, a lot of options you can choose from. However, I'm more interested in adding text along with GIFs let's add some text okay you can add multiple text options let's change the color okay let's position it here Okay, you can play with the stuff and change the colors, move the layers up and down. Let me change this and move it a bit. Okay, like this. You can add emojis or stuff like that to make it more appealing. but that actually depends mostly on your target audience. I don't know um, if your target audience would or, or would not enjoy this, that really depends on you. But for the most part that's it. After you finish editing and adding GIFs or whatever you like, it's really easy to add it on your website. You click on install code and copy this little script on your page. I would uh, like to recommend that you actually add more GIFs onto your thumbnail because that's the whole point of it, uh, that your video would stand out and be more clickable and attract the attention of your potential customers. I will do this right now and add a little more GIFs to make the thumbnail more animated. So let's say click you can actually upload your own GIFs if you want. 
but um, I'll just use what I can find on Giphy but look that's actually really nice it has multiple colors even though it doesn't fit this image it might fit other images as I mentioned before what you want to achieve with this is to make your video to stand out and make the traffic on your website become customers so that's basically it but if you need more than that you can opt for playboost pro this upgraded package will give you a lot of new options like text-to-speech technology that will make your lead capture a lot more efficient by using sound effects you also have the option to split test and see which type of thumbnail brings you more customers and a lot of premium done for your templates extra premium animations premium overlays fonts button templates and uh, pro analytics this will help you see what your customers actually want and uh, optimize your thumbnail for the best results you can get there are also other packages you can choose from but however i recommend the first one because it has the most options and you won't be needing the rest of them unless you want to sell licenses or you have an uh, agency so this was my review of playboost i hope it helped you and see you next time